Time to get collecting. Yes, so many amazing things. Kenny, I'm sure you can't even <laughs> scratch the surface out there with everything they have. Oh, Natalie, it is huge, Natalie and Todd. It's amazing. I mean, in so many different aspects, it's not just about sports memorabilia. I mean, they're going to have 150 different um, sports figures here to autograph. But imagine taking some images from some of the most popular sports cards and then turning them into art and actually adding some, uh, some items. I mean, the gloves here are literally from the hockey player that he put on his piece. We're talking about Murray Henderson, who's a tremendous artist, and he's going to be out here throughout the entire show. And how apropos, Murray is working on a piece with, yes, Jim Brown from the, the Cleveland Browns. Murray, thank you so much for coming out. Good to see you, bud. Thank you. Uh, for the record, like the Jordans. Oh, the yeah, Jordans thanks. are killer, man, like the Jordans. <laughs> All right, well, talk to us about your art. The whole concept is just something not many people have seen before, is it? No, it's actually quite new. Uh, I, I'm tying in lots of sports memorabilia into my art. Um, there's just there's an opportunity for people to display it in a different manner. Yeah, you know. and um, I love the, the dimension you give it with the, the different items and the texture, and then the way you do it, it just even if you don't use an additional item, it doesn't look like a traditional sports car, does it? Well, exactly. I, mean, I call mine exact abstract. I try to get the realism, but then the rest is an abstract aspect. So it's totally different. People say they've never seen anything like it. And since it is it's unique, how popular has it become over since you've been doing it? It's become very popular, especially the Jordan shoe one. <laughs> <laughs> Most definitely. Yeah. And I see you have hockey. I see you have Bobby Orr, you have Walter Payton, you have Babe Ruth. We saw Dylan, you had Dylan over here. So um, do you, does the climate dictate what's popular or is are you a true artist? Whatever hits you, hits you, when it hits you, how it hits you. You know what, anything that's pop, pop culture is kind of what this show is all about, I think, as well. It's like, it's not just about hockey and baseball and basketball cards anymore. It's, yeah. it, it's art, it's uh, old movies, it's comics. All of that is all tied in, and I think that's the most important part, is that art is the number one investment in the world, really. Uh, so people invest in cards, they can invest in art and cards. What a great avenue for artists like yourself to be able to bring people into the art world, period, because they might start with, with the Murray piece, and then, well, gee, if there's Murray out there, let me start exploring some different abstract. They didn't know they liked abstract until they got introduced to your type of abstract. Exactly, and it can be the opposite too. There's a lot of people who like photorealism and they want something abstract or, you know, like it just totally, it's, it's, it's such an incredible industry that, um, especially this one, people tie all the same likes and loves in, like hockey, basketball, right. it doesn't matter. It's, it's well, as we finish, we're going to have you put some finishing touch. Now, you guys have to understand, yesterday this was a blank canvas, so this is just a day's worker for Murray, and he's doing this great piece uh, of Jim Brown, which is truly amazing. I mean, you really probably haven't seen this ever before. So, uh, we're right here at the IX Center. The show is going to be here for a couple of days. It is definitely worth your while. Swing by Murray's booth. You're going to be very impressed with what you see. All right, Todd, and naturally, back to you guys. I mean, look at this wow, place. Kenny. I mean, that's just insane, isn't yeah. it? That's amazing. That's incredible. Yeah.